I'm Sahar. I'm a woman in science. When I was six, I wanted to be a painter. At 12, I wanted to become the queen of the whole world. But by 21, I had absolutely no idea what I wanted to do with my life. A few years later, during a master's program in philosophy of science, while I was writing my thesis on defending the possibility of artificial general intelligence, I thought to myself, instead of arguing, why don't I actually build it? And that was when I realized who I really wanted to be and what I wanted to do for the rest of my life. Some people go after a purpose, to give their life meaning, to feel part of something bigger. For me, that's science. When I decided to become a researcher, for the first time in my life, I felt truly humble and selfless. I was ready to do everything I could, even if it meant only a small contribution toward a goal that thousands of other researchers are also working on, and to feel proud when someone else reaches the finish line. That, I believe, is a sacred mission to push the boundaries of humanity's knowledge and power. I had many sharp turns in pursuit of my dream and made many risky decisions, moves that are hard to survive without a strong support. For me, that support always comes from my parents. They are both strong, independent, resilient individuals who have made their own way against all odds and never expected anything less from me. Now may be the best time ever to start a career in science as a woman. Policymakers recognize the importance of women's presence in science and are supporting it. So put yourself out there. We are not afraid to be bold. We are women in science.